Welcome to the lesson on One Rescuer BLS in Children. In this video, we'll discuss step-by-step -step procedure for providing BLS in children with One Rescuer. If you're alone with a child in a life-threatening situation, first tap their shoulders and talk loudly to them to determine if they're responsive. Then assess their breathing. If the child does not respond and is not breathing or is only gasping for air, then yell for help. If someone responds, send them to call 911 and get an AED. If you're not in a healthcare facility, or activate emergency response system and get a defibrillator if you are in a healthcare facility. Feel for the child's carotid pulse on the side of the neck or femoral pulse on the inner thigh in the crease between their leg and groin. Feel from no more than 10 seconds. If you cannot feel a pulse, or if you're unsure that you feel a pulse, begin CPR by doing 30 compressions followed by two breaths. If you can feel a pulse, but the pulse rate is less than 60 beats per minute, begin CPR. This rate is too slow for a child. After doing CPR for about two minutes, which is usually five cycles of 30 compressions and two breaths, and if help has not arrived, call EMS while staying with the child. The AHA emphasizes to use speaker-equipped cell phones that are available everywhere now. Get an AED or a defibrillator if you know where one is. Use and follow the prompts on the AED or defibrillator while continuing CPR until EMS arrives or until child's condition normalizes. This concludes our lesson on one rescuer BLS in children. Next, we'll review two rescuer BLS in children.